Farmers will want to attend an evening field day scheduled for Thursday, hosted by the Plymouth County Soil and Water Conservation District and the Deep Creek Water Quality Initiative Project. Dennis Morris with KLEM Radio of Lamars tells us more about the field day. The field day will be held at the Gary Lango Farm, located at 38482 on Highway 3, just east of Lamars. And speaking at the field day will be Iowa State University Extension and Outreach Crop Specialist Joel DeYoung. DeYoung says that the focus will be on our soils found in northwest Iowa. What we're really going to do is we're going to talk about uh, practices to preserve that magnificent resource we got, which is our soil. The Deep Creek Watershed Project is looking at uh, uh, putting practices in place to reduce erosion, putting practices in place to reduce the amount of phosphorus and nitrate that hit, to our, hit our surface waters. We're actually going to do a closer look that evening of looking at what the soil looks like at two different parts of the field. One on a little steeper slope, one on a little flatter slope. We're going to be able to look at that soil type and demonstrate what actually has occurred over time. You know, moving that topsoil away from where it started and maybe not having it as deep as it used to be. DeYoung says that farmers will be able to observe two different areas where a backhoe has dug a trench so farmers can see the layers and depths of topsoil and subsoil. We're going to look at about a five foot deep trench. We're going to look to see what the corn root systems do when they get into that soil. We're going to take a look at, uh, you know, the surface that has the organic matter enrichment. We're going to take a look at how deep it is, sloped hillside versus a flatter hillside, and do some comparison there and talk about how the root systems and the crop interacts with that soil resource itself. DeYoung says that the trench will be five feet deep because oftentimes corn roots will penetrate the soils at that depth. DeYoung says that discussion will also focus on the amount of soil lost each year due to erosion. He says that in one year, as much as five tons of soil can be lost per acre. He says it's oftentimes difficult to visualize what five tons of soil may look like. He says if you imagine a side dump truck filled with soil, that would be approximately 20 tons of soil or the amount of soil lost each year from four acres. DeYoung says that he'll compare the amount of soil loss to the amount of crops harvested. And he says that discussion will also be directed at opportunities available to farmers and landowners for cost share conservation practices to help eliminate or greatly reduce soil erosion. That field day is scheduled to begin at 6 p.m. on Thursday. An evening meal will also be served. For KCAU 9 News, I'm Dennis Morris.